What it do, Cosmic Crew? Like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Without further ado, I got another video for you. So as you can see, this video is about XXX Tentacion. Okay. If you know me, you know it takes a lot for me to <laughs> come up and do these readings. So we're just going to get straight to it. Okay, now. Right off the bat, this has something to do with YNW Melly. Okay, this involves um, Trippy Red, Ski Mask, um, Quavo, Drake. Juice World, Pop Smoke, Kodak Black, Rod Wave, French Montana, NBA Young Boy and Lil Dirt. I feel like there are different sides and different divisions and different like it's like a fraternity. I say it all the time. You kind of got to make a pledge and pick a side. Okay. Some people are renegades. Also, XXX is a he's a time traveler. He's somebody who kind of um jumps in and out of timelines. He's a prophet. He comes back from the future and warns people things. He's a Martian. Yeah, there was a lot of um, dark, evil magic being sent in that play here. Okay. There's also this energy of someone who is trying to poison him. Someone was trying to call his bluff. I feel like he was also calling out the elite. This was a spiritual war that was going on. Definitely involving a Scorpio here. There was a Scorpio that was um very silent but deadly. Someone was enlisting armed forces but like in the spiritual realm so there was a Scorpio that was the reason that he was facing a lot of legal troubles and like stopping his bags and his contracts this has to do with Birdman as well Something about freelancing, wanting equality, some type of business partnership, or trying to negotiate his contract. But see, they wanted to do those group sex rituals. It always comes out. Some type of... Clarify this. What are, what are these rituals about? It, a lot of it, they may have been trying to sleep with his mother. Also, his girlfriend. And, like, their girlfriends and, like, swingers and entanglements. And, like, you switch partners and something about a bowl of keys. And you grab the keys and whoever's keys it are is who's you, who you sleep with. And also, I feel like he may have been wanting to out people's sexuality or protest against some some type of homosexual activities. There's a Leo here. Something about 
some medication or like marijuana. Some somebody was um is definitely a heavy smoker. There's also something here about cloning and a doppelganger. So someone may have been put in some type of medicated state due to pres prescription pills. And there was somebody around that was pretending to be them. Divine timing. There's somebody who had a friend here, but the friend was like a doppelganger. I keep seeing Inali Chaka and this and that nigga that looked just like him. There's a lot of stunt doubles, clones, doppelgangers, like monkey see, monkey do shit. Like these, like these, it's just like Slim Shady. Like they have all these niggas that look like you and they, it gets really creepy. There's something about a really um, feminine, intuitive, maternal energy. Somebody who's um, a diamond. Very precious. There's somebody here about uh, a spiritualist. Somebody who may be living single. And they're single right now. Where are we going with this? This, this is mainly about a Scorpio. There's a Scorpio that is at the root of the um, demise of XXX and Tashion. I'm going to say, I just got to call it out, it's Drake. Like, he's he's a federal agent. He's, he's an informant here. There's something about um, a lot of the domestic violence disputes. I feel like Drake was trying to fuck his girl or, like, fuck his mama or some shit. There's also a Sag here, a Sagittarius, that's a doormat, a pushover, okay? I feel like, yeah, they wanted they wanted Juice World to be some type of doormat, but they always, they, they sick these women on these young boys that are very impressionable. They know your type, and they know your vices, okay? So I don't know who this girl fucked that got him in some type of domestic dispute, but everybody knows about it. There was like all this gossip, gossip, drama, something, but it was like a sex ritual. I feel like they underestimated his mind. He's very tech savvy. I feel like he knew that he was being watched to monitor. He may have had VPN blockers and all this shit. There's something about a Virgo here. A significant other. Or someone that he thought he could he could trust enough to love. Whoever they are, they're not very um, good-hearted or kind-hearted. Very impatient. Emotionally imbalanced. I feel like he just wanted to provide and become very grounded. He was very considerate, but strong-willed, but very practical as well. But there's something about this evil eye, always receiving the evil eye because of other people's insecurities and always having to, like, cleanse himself. Yeah, there's also something about transmitted diseases. We're going to leave it right there for now. Okay. <laughs> Until next time.